welcome to another video today we're gonna test out the USB 3.0 SATA hard drive adapter and here we have we're gonna try it on a DVD a SATA DVD one terabyte hard drive from Western Digital and another old hard drive from X cell store which I'm not familiar with this one seems to be very old and uh, this one is 160 gig and then I have a laptop SSD Samsung and this one is also showing us one terabyte Okay, so this is the front of the packaging and this one is the back of the packaging okay let's try open it up so you will find manual so user manual and the device itself over here so it's USB and then this is the SATA adapter and then at the back it has a AC DC 12 volt power but it didn't come with the package but I do have a few of those from other devices for example I have one that came from LED light strips so I can use that okay so let's test it now okay for this testing I'll be using a Lenovo ThinkPad laptop so right now I'm only one drive that's letter C and then I'm gonna plug it in uh, this one goes to USB port right here then let's try out first the laptop SSD so there, there's light there's some light there And then yeah it managed to detect it immediately the DVD drive let's see if we can use it as a portable DVD drive okay it turned on let's see if it's gonna work okay it works it managed to power on Okay, so here on my PC, it's now showing there is a DVD drive. So it means it managed to make it work. So I'm just not sure if it's actually a faulty one. It's the TP-Link T1 201002B1 it's a adapter for a modem so I'm just gonna plug that in here 
and then I'm gonna plug it into hard drive yeah there is vibe okay yeah it managed to read it so, okay now I'm gonna plug it into this hard drive Okay, there's no response no response whatsoever on this hard drive so I think that it really needs a power source to be connected here because it didn't really feel anything there let's try yeah on, on this Western Digital it starts to spin I can feel that it's vibrating the hard drive and it managed to read it in less than 30 seconds I think alright so in summary we can conclude that it works on a desktop hard drive it works with a laptop hard drive and it also works with a DVD SATA however on the package you don't have the AC adapter so uh, this one only comes in the package and if you want to make it work using a desktop hard drive, you're going to need an AC adapter. Preferably an AC adapter that is from like a modem. Like this one, it's a TP-Link. Anyway, that's all I can share with you today. I'll end this video here and as always, thank you for watching. Cheers.